I hear a lot of buyers talk about down payment and saving up for closing costs, but after spending the last few years working exclusively with home buyers, I can tell you there are some costs that are always coming up as a surprise, no matter how prepared home buyers think they are. My name is Nicole Nark. I am a real estate professional in central Arkansas. And today I want to share with you three hidden costs that even the most prepared home buyers often aren't thinking about. On top of saving up for your down payment, other things like closing costs, there are some hidden fees and other things that you're going to have to pay for even before you get the keys and close on the house. The first one of those is a home inspection. I advise every single person who is buying a house to get that house inspected. This is a small expense to the vast, vast inspection process that can save you thousands of dollars in the long run because who knows what kind of problems could be potentially lying in the house that you're considering purchasing. In central Arkansas, these home inspections typically range from around $350 to $500, depending on the area, the size of the house, things like that. Now in your area, they could be a little bit different in price, but reach out to your local real estate professional and they can likely give you a good idea. It's super important to hire a home inspector and you're probably going to do this within around the second week of being under contract. That way you have enough time to get the home thoroughly inspected and potentially negotiate repairs. The second hidden cost when buying a home can be the appraisal. Now, a lot of times the appraisal that the bank orders when they have an appraiser come out to your house completely separate from the home inspection and assess its value for the loan. Because remember, the bank isn't going to give you more money to buy this house than what the appraised value is because they're not going to allow you to overpay for it. Sometimes these banks will charge you the appraisal fee up front rather than charging it to you at closing. So that's something that you want to make sure you find out on the front end, but a lot of people don't until they're getting a call from their lender and all of a sudden their lender needs 500 to thousand dollars from them that they didn't have saved up. Yikes. Another small, but if forgotten about, costly hidden fee associated with buying houses is utility activation. In the majority of states, if you allow the sellers to shut off their utilities to the house before you activate them in your name, you are going to be charged reactivation fees. Now, in my area where the cost of living is actually pretty affordable, this can get really expensive. This can be a couple hundred dollars just in fees to have someone come back out to the house and switch on the gas that was just turned off maybe a day or even hours beforehand. So in order to avoid paying this, if possible, get with your real estate agent and find out when the seller of the home you're buying is going to have those utilities off and make sure you turn them into your name beforehand. So as you can see, these three hidden costs can easily add up and you could be spending over a thousand dollars really quickly on things that you were not prepared for when buying your house. And that can eat into your cute decor, excess furniture budget, or potentially getting a new refrigerator. If you have any more questions about the costs associated with buying a home, let me know in the comments below. I am more than happy to answer any questions that you might have about the process. And in the meantime, happy house hunting.